Hello, friend, and welcome to the Watchman on the Wall channel. This prophetic word excerpt comes from Donna Rigney from Salt Spring, Florida. Fire and glory are coming. On April 12, 2024, while in the Spirit, I had a wonderful encounter with Father. He explained, Many are the delights I will be pouring out on my children. It will overflow onto the world. Yes, as my children are equipped with my glory and power, miracles will impact the people in the world. This will bring forth a great harvest of souls. Fiery coals from heaven will purify the lips, words, and hearts of the masses. As Isaiah was chosen and sent for us to speak my words, so too will those that are purified. They will be used by our hands to gather in the lost. They will be formally aligned with and encouraged in their sinful ways. Isaiah 6, 1-9 Revival fires will spread stronger and faster than a contagious disease. My children that carry my fire, they will ignite the dry sticks, the hearts that they encounter. And then those newly on fire ones will go forth and spread my fire. As the enemy has used people to spread his wickedness, I will in turn use my people to spread my goodness. But when the Holy Spirit controls our lives, he will produce this kind of fruit in us, love and joy, peace and patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Galatians 5, 22-24 Lord, I pray that your fire and your glory falls on us. Lord Jesus, that we would speak what you would have us speak. And Lord, that, that the words that we, that we speak would be, would be empowered by the Holy Spirit to set the captives free. Lord, to rekindle the, the embers of those who have grown cold or have, have turned away from you. Lord, I pray that the revival fire would spread. Lord, I pray that my friend and I would take part in that today. Encouraging others, believer and non-believer alike, Lord. I thank you, Father, that we were, we were built for this time, that we were created for right now, friend. We are not accidents, but we fit into God's plan for today. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen.